Hi guys, my name is Green Eye James Curl and welcome to another Sims Free Play video. We are continuing with the Night of the Candy Monsters quest. This quest is completely different from how quests have been previously. It came out with the Monsters and Magic update. The quest has a limited time of nine days to win a witch, ghost, pirate, zombie and more costume pack for your Sims. But it is split into different parts. So we've just completed the first part and won a prize and then you can either wait until it's available to you because I completed it too quickly or you can press and skip task for five LPs and then we do a next set of tasks within the quest so it's quite confusing for this little section of the quest we will win when we complete it a astronaut adorable astronaut costume set for your toddler sims okay so what do we need to do form a party plan Scaring the purple monsters is working and your sim is one step closer to making the Halloween party happen. It's time to start planning for it. Have a sim form a party plan with another sim. So we've got two sims. Let's click form a party plan. It takes five minutes. So let's get that started now. Here we go. We have got a party plan. Next, send Halloween invitations. First things first, you need to send out invitations so that others can prepare in time. Have a sim send out Halloween invitations from a computer. Okay, go ahead and click on a computer. Halloween invitations, that takes 12 minutes. Halloween invitations have been sent out. Let's see the next thing. If you can hear purring, I'm sorry about that, my cat is sat right by the microphone. Uh, let's just move over slightly. Next thing we need to do is ask Misty for advice. Invitations are sent, but your guests are worried there won't be enough costumes to go around. There must be better ways to scare candy out of the monsters. Ask Misty for advice. Okay, here she is, floating around. Ask for advice takes 7 hours and 30 minutes. We finished asking Misty for advice. The next thing that we need to do is practice scaring. Misty shows your sims a spectacular new scaring technique and suggests continuing to level up your scare skill by practicing on another sim. Have a sim practice scaring another sim. Okay, where's another sim? Here we go. Should we use these two that are dressed up in their outfits from the last part? Practice scaring eight seconds. There we go. Oh, <laughs> jumped out of her skin. That would scare me, to be honest, if somebody came up behind me looking like that. Here we go. Practice scaring completed. Show off scaring skill. Misty's scare techniques really worked. Your sims have been scaring each other silly. Happy sims show off their scaring skill to Misty. So let's click on Misty. Just floating around the house. So show off skill. That takes eight hours and 30 minutes to do that. Oh, look at her creeping. Showing Misty how it's done. Showing a ghost how to scare people. I don't think she probably needs to show him. Show off scaring skill is now finished. I love that outfit. Absolutely love it. Uh, the next thing we need to do is to scare the orange candy monster. Misty is so impressed by your Sims scare skills, she shrieks and fades away. Your sim sees an orange monster nearby. Whew. Shouldn't be a challenge after scaring Misty. Have a sim try to scare the orange monster. Okay. Um, oh, here she is. Orange monster. Oh, this is so cute, these monsters. Right, so you should just get one turning up at your door like I have. That takes eight seconds to scare her or it. See if we can scare it. Doesn't look scared to me. They are so cute, those outfits. Look at all those eyes on the top of their head. Cute. Okay, that is finished. Scaring the orange monster. Pout on a seat. The orange monster laughs at your sim. You want to scare me? Impossible. It laughs again before disappearing. How disappointing. Have a sim pout on a seat. Okay, so that didn't really work. So I think we can pout. Yeah, we can do it on a dining room chair or sofa. Any type of chair you can do this on. But pout takes 10 hours. There we go, he's finished the pouting. The next thing we need to do is to ask Misty what happened. Your sim uncrosses their arms and looks up as Misty reappears. She looks shaken. Was she scared by the orange monster? Have a sim ask her what happened. Okay, where is Misty gone? Um, 
So there she is, floating around the house. Let's ask what happened. That takes 25 minutes. We have finished asking Misty what happened. Oh, off she goes, floating along by. Next thing, collect candy pieces. Misty says the orange monster collects the costumes to become the scariest monster ever. The purple monsters are helping. Your sim must thwart that evil plan. Have his sim find purple monsters and scare more candies out of them to trade for more costumes. So we need to collect 30 candies this time. So like in the previous part of the quest, we had to get um, candies from the purple monsters. We have to do it again in this part, but this time we need to collect 30. Right, so we've got a load of purple monsters running around now. So let's click on one. Collect candy. This takes four hours and 30 minutes. I wonder if we can do more than one at a time. Oh, yeah, we can. Look. So if you are not, obviously I'm going to speed this up for video purposes, but if you are not speeding it up, just know that you can just click on all of the monsters that there are and do it at the same time. So that's pretty handy to know. So it looks like we're going to get four pieces of candy from each time we scare a monster. Like with the previous time, I'm assuming that monsters will just appear. So you just have to wait and they will just keep appearing. So we're going to go ahead and collect all the candy pieces that we need for this. How many did we need again? We needed 30. We have collected all the candy pieces. You have to do it eight times in total, although you can do it more than, you can have one, more than one sim doing it at a time. So we have completed that. I think that that will take us, yeah, there we go. Congratulations, your toddler sims can pretend they are astronauts any time of year with this costume set. We'll take a look at them. Two more costumes recovered. Your sim has been scaring monsters all day and needs a rest. Oh. So we can wait for three days, nine hours, or we can skip for five. We're going to go ahead and skip. Let's go and check out those prizes. Here we go. I've got my male toddler sim in a wardrobe. Well, not in a wardrobe, you know what I mean, <laughs> in the wardrobe. And these are the two new outfits that we have got. We've got this astronaut and... This, I'm assuming that these aren't gender specific and that these are the two new outfits, but let's just go ahead and we'll double check what the choices is, choices are for a female toddler. Here we go in the female toddler and no, they're the same two outfits. So it's those two outfits that we won with this part of the quest. Oh, and look, they, um, they hop around when they walk. <laughs> that is so adorable. There you go, guys. That completes the second part of the Night of the Hidden Candies quest. I will put a link on the screen now and down below in the description for the next part as soon as I complete it. But thank you so much for watching this video. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. And I will see you guys soon for a new video. Bye!